Hi friends, this is Ken Bailey. On May 29th of this year, 2021, the Lord took me into an over two hour vision. And for the first time in my life, I got to see him. I was shocked. He was coming down uh, out of heaven, a veil opened, and I saw clouds roll back and Christ rode out on a white horse uh, with his crowns on, his red robe, and he rode towards me and on down to the earth and uh, I got to see him and it was magnificent. I'm so blessed to have experienced that. Uh, then 21 days later, the Lord said to me, Ken, get on your computer and go to the Shroud of, of Turin. I went to the Shroud of Turin and uh, I, I saw images, I opened it up and I was shocked. I couldn't believe it. There was, the, there was a picture on the Shroud of the Turin of Jesus Christ that I had seen in the vision on May 29th. And in that vision, Christ had woolly white hair, a white beard, and uh, I was now looking at that very image. It was so hard to explain it to people, and now I could actually share it with you. I'd always been taught that the Shroud of Turin was a fake, that carbon-14 testing had dated it to the 12th or 13th century. So I've never in my life paid any attention to the shroud. But 21 days after the, that vision, uh, the Lord t asked me to go and look at the shroud of Turin. And he, and he said to me, I, that is my burial cloth. I have preserved that, that for the world. And in the last days, the Lord said knowledge would increase. And in his last days, the technology now exists where a, a negative uh, could be developed off, uh, off of the shroud, the burial cloth, to produce an image of the face of, of Christ with his eyes closed. And that image was taken just as, as God the Father was raising Christ back to life after three days uh, there in the tomb. And so the Lord wants me to share with all of the world and let everyone know around the world the Shroud of Turin is real. It is the burial cloth of Jesus Christ. I've been blessed to see Christ in that vision and the Lord directed me to, to the Shroud of Turin and it is authentic. The Lord has preserved this for the very end of time in these last days. Uh, th this is not what to base your faith on. We base our faith on the word of God. Uh, it's the inerrant, infallible uh, word of God. But this strengthens my faith that I've seen Christ, that the Shroud of Turin is the burial cloth of Christ, also the face cloth that they have, have also kept all of these years is that of Christ uh, as well. So I'm excited to share with you today that you can see what I saw in that vision, uh, an image of Jesus Christ. He's returning soon in the rapture and the tribulation is gonna begin on the earth. Use the Shroud of Turin to, t to show people uh, Jesus, to tell them that, uh, that he's real, that he really did live, and he died a horrendous death. There are over 600 marks on the body of Christ uh, in, in that burial cloth of the shroud. It's been researched so much uh, since 1978 when they worked on it and did countless tests uh, on the shroud. But I'm happy to say now that the, God blessed us in these last days and preserved that burial cloth uh, for all the world to see and to have that Jesus Christ really did live. He did go to the cross. He suffered a terrible, brutal death. And you can see the images uh, in, in, uh, of, of where the nails went in at his wrist, the uh, um, marks of the thorns on his brow, uh, all, of, all of this is, you can see it. So I encourage you, get on YouTube, get on uh, Google, other places, look at the Shroud of Turin, share it with, with others. It's, it is a real, it is the burial cloth of Jesus Christ. I hope this encourages you and you'll share Christ with others. God bless you all.